It is Thursday, the 31st of August, and first and foremost, you'll notice that I am not in Nashville. Yeah, um, I overslept. I missed my flight. I needed to get up at three something in the morning and I got up at six something in the morning. Uh, Serena and I both set alarms on our phones and it just didn't work, I guess. I don't know, there's no excuse for it. Either which way, uh, it was significantly disappointing to miss that, but not significantly disappointing that my concession to it was getting to hang out and work from home with my beautiful wife also here too. And she had a day off, of course, so she did a puzzle, which is pretty cool. Serena's like the puzzle princess or puzzle queen, I guess. I don't know where she stands in the whole patriarchy, but she is a puzzle royalty to say the least. And she completed this Disney puzzle, which I don't know that I would have even been able to start. Like you look at it, like just from a box art perspective, and it uses the same like four colors over and over again. I would see the pile of those puzzles and I'd go into a fit. I'd convulse, I'd throw up. But she finished it in like, I don't know, two hours, maybe less. Something interesting though, is that there was an extra piece. There is an extra part of Belle's nose there. Does that imply that there's like another version of this or another copy of this puzzle out there somewhere in circulation that someone is missing that specific piece of. They're flipping over the furniture, they're dumping out their litter box, convinced that they've misplaced it or it flew away somehow. I don't know, I hope not. I hope there's just an extra, but I can't imagine that that's something they just get an extra from, right? Because they take the puzzle and it's a picture and then they cut it up and then they slide that out, so. <laughs> Uh, I think the implication is that someone is in fact missing it, and that's too bad. Uh, we got it from the book rescuers, actually, the puzzle that is, and they had a few of them. I don't know if they had a great many, but this definitely wasn't the only one of that puzzle that they had for sale there. So maybe if we go back to the book rescuers sometime and, you know, hear the owner complaining about someone complaining to him about a puzzle missing a piece, then we can be like, hey, we found it. But barring that, and of course that's very unlikely as it is, uh, <laughs> we will just continue to have a uh, 501 piece puzzle, which again is far outside the scope of what I can complete. Um, outside of that, my work, Serena's day off, um, this evening I have been able to do a lot of catching up, mostly on the vlog, uh, because I was the furthest behind, but then also on the Let's Play stuff, I'm, I'm A and B testing a new sort of thing I'm gonna do with Let's Play episodes, and I'll actually talk more about that tomorrow because that's when it starts. So remind me. You won't be able to remind me, but remind me. Uh, and that's pretty great that we're already catching up on everything though. Uh, in earnest, things won't be caught up on until this weekend, which is a holiday. It's Labor Day, which is crazy. Um, there will be labor on Labor Day, but instead of like laboring for, for work, I will be laboring for for other work. <laughs> so instead of corporate work, I'll be on fun work, okay? Because YouTube and vlog and Let's Play and everything is definitely like laborious, but it's a labor of love. I, I enjoy it and I really do look forward to it. And we've found a way to continue having so much fun that we didn't miss a beat throughout the entirety of Hurricane Adalia. And I have you, Serena, to thank for that. Uh, for making it fun and for being consistent and we're up on Pikmin and we'll be able to record more Pikmin on Saturday and move into the next week like there was never any natural disaster at all, which is crazy. It's very impressive. If I do say so myself, I don't know, not to horn my own toots here, but we put forth a lot of time into doing this and I guess we wouldn't if it wasn't fun. Either which way, I'm rambling here and I hope you had fun. That's more important than anything at all. So thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it and I hope that you hated every second. I hope that you had fun. And with that said, I'll see you tomorrow.